my son. My son. Cause I, I just really couldn't. Like, I just went to sleep after I threw up. Uh, Blue calls me this morning and he's like, what do you say? Obviously, y'all see how I be on, like, locked down. Don't go nowhere. You feel me? I don't go nowhere. It's annoying sometimes. So, like, when I do go out, I do be, like, wanting to just cut loose and just be myself. You feel me? So, so when I did that yesterday, he, he like, well, so you went out and you didn't go home. And I'm just like, babe, I got drunk and I did go home. I went to where my son was at. Like, I could have went home and just left my son with, uh, you know, the babysitter, and he would have been fine till I, but I just wanted to go straight to my son, and then not like that, that's my house, like, you know, like, I have another house, so, I'm like, okay, I'm gonna just be over here, went to sleep, woke up, you know, stuff like that, Long story short, he calls me. He asks me about my whereabouts. I tell him. He's like, well, you, you're supposed to go home. I said, hey, can you just stop all that other shit? Like, well, you went out and da 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 You know how I, I know how you are, but babe, okay. I had too many drinks. Like, nobody's cheating. Pussy still fucking hairy as fuck growing. Like, this shit is, I can break this shit that's on my, like, I'm holding you down, bro. I'm paying your bills. Like. You 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 have to want to be here to benefit like you like you not I'm not benefiting from this shit but being here for him like you know like I love you you love me we 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 want to work things out try this whole different atmosphere cool that's great I'm all down for it so then we're on the phone and he keeps talking about so why didn't you go home I was like I told him why he's like well well he kept trying to like argue with me and I was just like bro. Fuck you, bro. Like, what are you arguing with me for? I went outside. Well, well, da, 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 da. bro, I'm not cheating on you. Like, not like that, but like, we're grown, my nigga. Like, if you outside, when he used to go outside, cool. When I used to do my little dirt, cool. it wasn't cool, right? We are... No, it was just his feelings was hurt because I hung up on him. I hung up on him, and I was just like, I didn't care what he wanted to say. And it was only because I'm just frustrated as a, as a mom right now. Like, you know, like, look, I put myself through a lot of things in this relationship. I sacrificed a lot. My identity, pretty much. Everything. So it's like, all right, you know what I'm saying? I'm not willing to redo the same shit. You feel me? Cool. I get where you're like arguing with me about and all this other stuff, but you really have to just trust that I'm not doing nothing. You feel me? And if you don't trust me, then that's a personal problem. That's like something that we can't really, you know? Like, I don't know. Like, and I'm not good at arguing no more. Like, I don't know how to argue. So I guess me hanging up on him, he thinking like, oh, I know what to do. Let me tell Bo, do this and do that. Baby, that is fine. What the hell? Like, I didn't, first of all, I didn't get this tattoo for Instagram. I didn't unfollow everybody and just follow you for Instagram. I did that for you. You feel me? I'm doing all this for him. I'm not doing this for people when people da 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 Like, but I, and I'm like, okay, and that's cool, but I'd rather you, like, Feel the way you feel instead of, like, I don't know, making me feel like I'm doing something wrong. Like, that's how you feel. Then you're entitled to how you feel. But. You feel me? And then I was I was saying hurtful things, though. I really was. So. I don't know what the fuck he think. This is, I really don't care. It's nothing like you can do to hurt me more. Like I've been through so much with him. I don't really, you know, care for real. Like I don't need you, you don't need me. 
we we're with each other because we want we want that. We want that. You feel me? Yeah, but it's not about the money. That's the other thing, bro. Like, you know how much money I got? I don't care. You feel me? And not like that. It's like, all right, I'm I'm the type of bitch that know how to play my role. Like, all right, I got you, yo. You feel me? Like, I got you. I got you. I got you. Don't be getting mad because I didn't go home. I did go home. I went to my house. And if you would have called me, I would have answered. Like... The other, it's funny because the night before that, he was on the phone with me 24 hours, like literally. When I went out, he called back in like another hour, like, hey, where you at? Hey, where you at? So I'm thinking he's going to do it again. Like, keep calling me. If he called me, I would have answered and like, hey, I'm fucked up. Da, da, da. I can't do shit. Da, da, da. I'm right here. I'm at my house. You didn't call me. That's on you or why you don't know where I'm at or I don't know like cause if you if you mad at me for not answering the phone that's one thing you feel me but I answer my motherfucking phone any and everywhere I'm at like the hell we don't do that with each other what happened to my music my music I, bro I have all my I have a whole tape ready I have features well, great artists. I have shit lined up. I'm waiting on him, like, on purpose, though. Not because I need to, not because I know in this time period I needed to go on my turtle show. So it's not even about him necessarily, too. Like, I like this time that I got to focus on my son, save money, and just focus on my son. Like, just focus on my son. Focus on my son. Pour into him. Pour into everything about him. Just, it's like when you have when you have a baby, it's like you need this grace period from not working type shit. And then, And then he's doing his power trip when we beef. Like, how was we beefing over Joe because I didn't go home or you didn't call me to see where I'm at and now you're scared because you don't know where I've been at or what you scared for? Like, you feel me? It's crazy. But my thing is, why why trip about something that's not even, like, relevant to trip about? Like, yeah, I said those hurtful... Because, yeah, I said some shit. Like, I was... What I say? He was trying to make a point. I'm like, why are you being so evil on the phone, babe? You had the opportunity to call me all night, and you know I would have picked up. We're not even arguing about me not picking up or nothing. We're arguing about... Why well, I didn't go to this house, but I was at home with my child. I just needed to be around my child. Yes, I had people in my family helping me watch my baby when I was out doing me cool. And then he was like, uh, what else did he say? He was just trying to make his point. I didn't just sit there and be quiet. And I think the real reason why I didn't just sit there and be quiet is because, like, um, I'm doing a lot. And I'm doing a lot for somebody that showed me completely pure shit. So just because you have a change of heart all of a sudden doesn't mean I'm not still dealing with our past trauma. One. Two. I took the initiative to what? So you don't have to call Bobo or Wack or any of these people to be in your business, get your account situated, or I don't know, spend money on this. Like, I got you, cool. I got you, cool. And it, we're not talking about 
Oh, a couple hundred dollars. We're talking about thousands of dollars. We're talking about your lawyer fees. We're talking about um, the restaurant that's not open. Well, the building, yes, it's getting remade inside, whatever, but you still have to pay rent every month. I've been paying that since he's been locked up. That ain't no... But it's 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 fifteen thousand every so I pay every two months. So I pay two months whole. Seven 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 hundred and six hundred something plus woo woo times two. I just say fifteen. Like 'cause it's like a sketchy number that he say, Oh pay this and I'm just like, Why can't you just go to the nearest hundred? It's like awkward. So long story short, every two months I'm giving fifteen thousand for rent for his restaurant. Like I'm offering, I'm 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 willingly doing that. You don't have to tell me. You don't have to ask. I'm willingly doing that. What? That's just Yeah, he's in his bouncer bouncing, jumping up and down. That's him. Yeah, right. <laughs> And he's hitting this thing that goes on his little mountain. So it's like I'm willingly being there for you, and you're just like mad as mad as fuck about what I said. And what I said was mean. And I don't know how you're supposed to talk to people in jail. It's just sometimes you just had enough. Like he'll say some shit, and I'll be just like, I get what you're saying, babe, but you're making it seem like that. You're winning from this situation more than I am. So why are you making it seem like, you know, like somebody tricking us? You're not my trick. Like, I'm actually your teammate that's actually helping you win. Nobody, it's funny, nobody, nobody can't bring me down, bro. Like, nobody can bring me down. Nobody can bring. Not, not, I don't even think we're actually beefing. I feel like he's just really mad at me because I said what I said. Like he was trying to prove his point of why. Cause it's like when I'm telling the truth, and yeah, I have nothing to hide, and I'm willingly paying your bills, and I'm doing all of this. I make sure all your packages is there every week. If I keep hearing negative shit, even when I'm telling the truth, yes, I'm gonna say, bitch, fuck you. And that's what I said. I called him a bitch. I said, fuck you. You're weird as shit. You're trying to argue with me. Like, like you, like, like, like you don't cost a lot. Bitch. The fuck? Like, what? I see if I was using you. I'm not using you. I'm here with you. So it's like, I know how, but again, Blue never been in jail. He never been in this position to actually need, need, need what he needs. You feel me? So I understand, like, the way he's getting mad. But for me, hell no. I cannot do this shit. I can't do this shit. Like, I can't take bullshit over the phone. I'll be like, fuck you. When I said fuck you, he wanted to delete shit off his page, unfollow me. I don't care. That's not. You should have did that before I paid your rent. You know what I'm saying? And then it's funny because I've been in the house not going out. Like sometimes I go out, boom, then I stop completely. Then I'm like, okay, this is not fun. Just not just like. Now I felt like a prisoner at the house. Like, yes, he's really childish. He's really child. He's being childish. He's being really childish. He's getting on my nerves. And. Instead of just sitting up and just shutting up on the phone, it's like, I can't sit and shut up on the phone and get disrespected by you because you're upset that I didn't go home. I did go home. I have another house. I'm still my own woman. I can go home. If you can't trust me to go to my other house, that's weird. What are we doing this relationship for if you can't trust me? You feel me? Like, if I can't trust you, I'm going to go with the next person or I'm going to be by myself. Okay. If that's how you feel about me, if you can't trust me, 
going home, then you could have called. You didn't call. It was just weird. And then I'm like, what do you mean? He's just on the phone talking shit. Like, I'm like, bro, I don't got to hear this shit, bro. I was like, stay locked up, bro. Fuck you. Fuck you, bro. I'm like, yeah, I was saying, yeah, I did say that. Yep, I was saying bad shit, but it was just like, yo. This shit hard for real. Like, it really is. Like, just being a mother is is beautiful. It's not hard. Like, being a mother is not hard at all. What's, what's hard about it is if you don't have support. You feel me? The support shit. Like, all right, cool. The support kind of, like, make you sad or something. All right, cool. I'm over here supporting myself and my child. Yeah, this is a nice... I like this house, but this is the very house I got kicked out of, you know what I'm saying? And I got my own house. So, you know, so it's not like the same, like, power trip you could do with me. Like, oh, I can say what I say and do what I do, and you got to put up with it because you have nowhere to go. No, I'm not putting up with your tone. Like, bro, fuck you. What, nigga, I got this big-ass tattoo on my face. If I was thinking about cheating on you, I would probably... Make sure it's fake and temporary, or you know what I'm saying. Like if I had this, the the, but it's so weird because this is so new to us. Like we never, we never said we was gonna be this loyal and be. We never did this before, so I guess like our past trauma is fucking up what's trying to be new. I don't fucking know. I just don't like it. Like. You have no business being with him after all he did to you. If he had to put this energy in that child, he would come out like a baccarat. What? I don't know what she's talking about. Uh, he was using you to get through. Because he's in jail, and that's why the Lord to is there. Oh, my gosh, I'm scared for you, baby. The funny thing is, my thing is, I just want you to, like, stand on what you said. One thing about Blue, he, he, don't, he don't say stuff and not do it for real. Like, all right. Blue, no, he has multiple females and da-da-da-da, 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 right? He expected me to submit to that and just not do my own thing. When I just did my own thing, didn't submit, all right, cool. He got the taste of his own medicine. Cool, cool, cool. But then again, nothing's cool about it because it's unfair because it's the double standard shit and blah, 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 blah. So that's when I went about my business, got my house, got my car. I have this weak spot for him, whatever the case may be. But it always been me running back to him for real. And it be times when he'll come back just for some, like, you know, spend time and shit. That's him coming back. But, no, I never seen him run back the way he just did. So, it's like, okay, you're running back, but what's up? It's cliche. It's very cliche all of a sudden you want to just get your life together because you're in jail. You know what I'm saying? But at the same time, in the word Proverbs, it's a... I don't know from word for word, but basically the logistics of it, you can look it up. It's in Proverbs. It says hurtful things will hap happen to you, like painful things will happen for you to change your ways. So it's just as much as it's cliche, it's in a word. So I'm like, okay, you know, maybe, you know, you really got to change your heart. But I told this nigga before, we, we, before he went in, I said, watch you want to just call me and make me your girl. He was like, no, I'm not. No, I'm not. And I was also the person, watch you get locked up, all this evil shit you're doing to my child and me. Watch watch God handle you. He get locked up. Like, I don't know. Long story short, I will say some shit and really know what's actually going on for, for me. It's no such thing as jail talk. 
You feel me? Blue's not broke, yo. He got money. When I get mad, I call him a broke nigga because he be doing broke nigga shit. Like, stop playing. You feel me? Woo woo. But in actual reality, he's not broke, bro. This nigga don't need me. I don't need him. So it's like, I think it's like an energy thing too. Like I have a good high energy. I'm very supportive. And when I make it, it and if and if I'm very supportive, I make however you feel. If you feel small, you're gonna feel big. Like I just have that natural effect just being who I am. So, you know. Yes, just as much as I need his help, he needs my help. Like, yeah, both ways. Then why are you paying his bills? Because that was offered. That wasn't, that wasn't, and, and me, it's not about money. It's not about money. It's really not. Like, I had to learn the hard way. Um, we was beefing, and I was entitled of the money that I did make him, you know? And I felt some type of way when he was like, you're going to leave with nothing because that's the way I found you, blah, blah. I instantly went to say no more. Now I know how to move when I, okay, cool. What? This time in a relationship, I'm going to have my own money, my own account. And I'm still going to give it away because I don't give a fuck. It's not about money. And I got a lot of money, so it's like, you know, that shit ain't nothing. So we pay rich nigga bills. No, you just pick up a roll and a trait when somebody actually needs you. Like, I wouldn't want him paying nothing. I wouldn't want him touching nothing. I want him to just worry about his mind and his spirit while you're in jail. I'll take care of the bills. All you got to worry about is getting through your time with your head on your shoulders. You know you don't need to call Bobo or Wack to pay this guy off. I got you. I got it. Why? Because that's just my heart, nigga. That is me. Nobody's not going to change me for being me. Like, you know what I'm saying? Like, you know... Y'all could call it slow, whatever you want to call it, but I really love unconditionally, and it's crazy. I really do. And so does he. And it's funny because I don't even point a finger. It's not like, um, as you, like, say, if, like, me, like, okay, back then, he was doing crazy shit, ooh, ooh, but I'd be mad at shit, ooh, ooh. That was because of me tolerating that shit, bro. And then when I stopped tolerating that shit, I had a whole insight of how not to put up with it ever again. You feel me? And then, say if I'm scared to speak up or stand up for myself, I'm not going to be scared to speak up and stand up for myself. You know why? Because I don't give a fuck about that shit no more. Like, I had to learn how to not give a fuck about shit and really just give a fuck about myself. What do that mean? If somebody hurt your feelings or did something wrong to you, they did something wrong to you. Hey, baby, so cute, you miss your mommy. Hey. <laughs> He's laughing and stuff. I don't really, um, I don't know. I don't know how to blame nobody anymore. Like, even when people do wrong shit to you and shit, it's not even, it's not even their fault. It's your fault. You know what I'm saying? For putting yourself in that predicament or, you know what I'm saying? So, like, my thing is you have to take full responsibility of not protecting yourself in all areas. And try to stand. He's going to try to stand on it. He, he, he's a hell of a stubborn ass person. He really is. He did that. But that's just basically letting, him, letting me know. Don't ever call him a bitch on the phone while he's talking. It's just, man, you know, it's like, yo. Bitch. You feel me? Bitch. Bitch. 
But not for real. Like, it's not that. It's like, bitch, for real? Like, I ain't even calling you a bitch. I'm just expressing myself, yo. This, because, what? It's a choice to be here. It's not because I have to be here. You know what I'm saying? So it's like, don't make me feel like this was the only option. This was the only choice. This was, this was wanted, bro. Like, don't make me feel like you can't trust me because you're insecure or you're going through what you're going through in these battles in jail. That's cool. Mm -hmm. Hey, man. <laughs> like, they move around and stuff. <laughs> like, yeah, you really growing up, yo. No, but I've been quiet out the way only because, like, you know, I, I, I realize, like, I'll go through stuff or do stuff or I'm just, just out living my best life, whatever the case may be. My light be, like, seeping in rooms that's not supposed to be there. Like, you know, like, like you'll see me at my worst only because it's, like, I've been played, like, I don't know. Like, it's like a chess thing. Like, when people make you go up against yourself and it's not necessarily... You for real, it was like manipulated that way. So I just I, I, I just I'm 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 just tired of being used for I don't know, like it's just like I can't put myself in that predicament no more to be like, oh well he did this well how did you let him? You feel me? Like I don't let people I'm not worried at all. I'm not. You said you're tired of being used, but you're voluntarily being used. No, I said I'm tired of being used incorrectly. I volunteer to show up. Like, you know, like, so what? You know, I really don't care. It's not hurting me. It's really not. It don't hurt at all. Like, when, when, when we was arguing, I was like, what's up? Like, you're still, like, arguing with me. Like, we're the same people. We're not the same people. Like, we changed, babe. Like, we grew past that. Okay, we have a new understanding, but we never practiced it when you was home. So now it's like you you spending all day long worrying about me and, say, and, and, and saying if I'm cheating on you and I'm not. Like... He's like, so why you ain't go home? I said, because I was drunk. Like, I didn't have the capacity to call my Uber and to get out. Like, I just couldn't do it. I crashed right on my couch. When I woke up, my family, my friends was there. My baby was great, fine. Like, 
Like, I just needed time to myself to cut loose. I'm tired of being a mom all day, 24-7. Sometimes you need that time to yourself to go out, get your nails done, go out, get drunk with your friends. I don't know. Just go out and just enjoy yourself. Like, I, that's what I'm not finna be getting in trouble. Like, don't get me in trouble with something that, you know, whatever. No, I did quit. I did quit drinking. And I took my shot yesterday because I had a horrible game. Like, I just, I would like to be more, like, this is this is the other thing I learned about myself. Like, the the person I am, the position I'm in, um, you can't ever go back to normal. Like, you can't just go back and go play with normal girls and da 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 Like, you can't just go back and do normal shit anymore. You'd be like a target just because of your light. And it's not necessarily you, them, or whatever. It's just that doesn't exist being normal. Like, people will try to dim my light, and it's annoying because it's not even my light. It's God's light. So it's like, I don't even have control over that. So... My spirit of discernment just know, like, oh, okay, I see what's going on. So I'll just try out next year, but this time I'm going to buy a team, like, buy a team, make it my own team, have more more, more control in this situation so I can play way more in my favor and not be something that, I don't know, that takes from my value. So that's pretty much where I'm coming from. Like, and then it's funny because I don't drink because I'm sad. Like, you know, when I drink and I'm sad, I will go live and tell y'all, yo, da 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 da. It's funny. I don't even complain no more of what I be going through. I just take it up with God and then, like, be mature about it for real. And then. Other things like drinking or smoking is not negative. Like, you don't want that to be a negative outlet. So that's what I was making that a negative outlet because I couldn't deal with my ne- negativity maturely. So me drinking now has is not a problem. Like, you know. Now, I'm just updating y'all because y'all are all my fans. Like, oh my God, what's going on Instagram? Nothing, y'all. It's because it's like I'm not up against nobody but myself, you know? Not a man, not who he's dealing with, or I'm just up against myself, you know what I'm saying? And I got to do what's best for my son. I got to do. What I feel like I, I want to do for myself, like, but I'm like, Blue, this is the longest I ain't did shit ever, like, ever. Every year of my entire life, I always productive or stuck to something, and then it worked out for me, and I'm just eating from it, eating from it. This season, after I had my child, and then I went through this weird-ass storm with Blue, and then he get locked up, and then I sit on hold, but I'm not, not necessarily hold, it's more like sit on su- a support system, in this man's corner, because I see the bigger picture, I see if what things would go, if it goes the way it's supposed to go accordingly, great. If not, I'm not gonna be sad about it, you know? I'm just gonna run it up. But I don't I don't stoop to people level to just, like, I, I used to do that. No, I'm not sad. I'm just in my thinking box. That's it. Like, 
like I already have my my thing lined out, you know? That's it. You just react. I mean, no, I'm just being transparent. I ain't reacting. Reacting is like, I mean, I react on the phone, of course. That's personal. That's me and him. Like, because, like, sometimes you just need to hear it. Like, like sometimes you blow up somebody so so big, they forget, like, what you done for them. Like, bro, I just been here obedient as fuck on good terms, doing my shit, supporting you, riding for you, stamping you, vice versa. Like, we don't owe this to nobody but to our happiness. Like, okay, you saying I actually make you happy. You really make me happy, so let's be happy together. Cool. All right, we doing it, and then out of nowhere, you feel some type of way because I went to my house. That's cool, baby, but that ain't fair. Like, you got me fucked up. So when he had me fucked up, I called him a bitch. I said, stay in jail. I could have just sat there and, and, and be scared of what his response would be if I did that. Or I'll just do that because sometimes I'm just tired of hearing something that's like, that's not enough. Like, I'm, I'm tired of hearing bullshit. You know, I don't, I don't like bullshit. Like, I don't like hearing shit that doesn't make sense of what we agreed on. If we agreed on this, I get it. He's like, you agreed. I know, but you have to also take in consideration. I've been locked up with you, bro. Okay, when I get drunk or try to go out and celebrate or whatever, you can still call me. Like, we can argue about me not answering. Don't argue about where I went. I went home. Well, you ain't go to my house. Okay, well, my child wasn't at your house. My child was at my house. And those trips are like 30, 40 minutes a drive. I was already... Like, bro, I was not making it. I was, <sighs> I drank way too fast. And then my tolerance, I'm thinking my tolerance is like, it's like, you know how I used to drink? I'm sorry, but I, I never, I was drunk, but I never like passed out or throw up. This time I passed out, threw up. I'm like, oh shit, I gotta go home. I didn't pass out, but before I, before I could feel me passing out, well, let me take my ass home. You didn't mean to say that I know it just triggered you. Yeah, like on the phone, like he just, yeah, like, yeah. I, it was annoying because it's like, I know it's something small, but something small really mean a lot to you because you're in jail. So I get it. I get it. But it's like sometimes when you focus on something so small and then forget about what's actually happening. That person like me, I felt so like defeated. Like, what's up? What? I'm not finna just argue with you. Fuck you, bitch. Woo woo. Hung up. He ain't called back. All I see is his little Instagram just changed. Okay, that's cute. That's not gonna make me mad. It will be bad. It's gonna make me wanna just wait for you to call back. Can we? Are you ready to talk? Or what? If you're not, then okay. Then just stand on it. I'm not over here. I don't know. I don't know how somebody could be pretending. You only be you can pretend if you're benefiting. I'm like, baby, I love you to death, but nobody can't be pretending with you. And I'm not even benefiting from the situation. You are. Your bills is getting paid. You got somebody to hold you down, all type of shit, and then it's the person you actually fuck with, like, yeah, your little flings or whoever you be in, in, intertwined in, you really don't actually really fuck with them, but whatever, you know what I'm saying, niggas got egos, niggas have to go through shit to know that, boom, God took what you actually really want, you had right in your face, and all of a sudden, you wanted me with you, and it's not because, oh, you locked up, the, no, you come home in a couple months. I know it's not jail talk, it's just the fact that you have to live something. But 
get revealed something and then try to double back on it. And then it's like, all right, let's work it out. Then it doesn't work out because we're still stuck on trauma. Like you're, you're stuck on me passing out at my house instead of like making it here. If I tell you I couldn't make it here and you could have still called me, I would have still answered. Like what the hell? You, it was funny because the, the day before that, he, I went out, but I'm like, you know, out, like, out, like, and basically posted up with, um, so Dr. Trev pulled up with some girls, um, I didn't know them, uh, I was like, all right, bet, we should just go out or whatever, we never really went out, like, we were just, we went to the liquor store, we drank something, shit, um, we 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 went to this one place, but I don't know. I just wasn't in the mood to really just be outside for her. I really just wanted to get drunk. So But he was on the phone the whole entire time of like the whole situation. He's like, You're going now, I'm like, Well not really not See what the plot is, but you're not outside yet. Like, you're not outside yet. We ain't really going nowhere yet. We went to this one uh, spot. In, uh, this one spot in uh, Sherman Oaks. Boom, we went to Sherman Oaks. And then, like, within five minutes, we left that location. They didn't have liquor that I wanted. I wanted Hennessy. They didn't have Hennessy. They had some vodka. I don't know what they had. It was just whatever. Boom. We go to the liquor store. But on my way to the liquor store, he calls me. He's like, you're going out. I said, well, I'm really just trying to get drunk. What, you want to stay on the phone? He's like, no, I don't want to uh, intrude. I said, you're not intruding, babe. I love you. You can stay on the phone. You feel me? Like, he like, no, no, no. You know, I don't want to be a part of it because, no, babe, you can stay on the Like, I have to keep saying it. So he finally stays on the phone. Um, he popped back in on the call. This one, I'm loaded. We're, I'm drunk talking all type of She's like, where you at? I said, what's the, then I asked him, like, what's that place that be, like, after hours for food? Uh, and he like, Barry's. I was like, oh, I'm about to go to Barry's, then I'm going to go home. He said, okay, cool. I said, you want to stay on the phone, right? Like, yeah. We're on the phone the whole ride there. We get there, he's still on the phone with me. He like, all right, babe, I'm going to put the phone down, watch TV, and then I'm going to come back. Da, da, da. He kept doing that the whole night. So I'm like, what was the problem? Like, like yesterday, you could have did the same thing yesterday. Like, you know how I am. I'm just out, but like, you know, like I'm not out getting distracted, posted up with a nick. Like I'm not out, like, you know, tripping. Yeah, I'm explaining myself because I really care for him. Yeah, you know? That's what it is. Yeah, baby. What you yelling at? What you yelling at? Huh? Huh? What you yelling at? Oh, you think so funny? <laughs> It's funny because he don't make me do shit, so I do what I want, you know? Like, everything I'm doing is the, out the kindness of my heart. And I don't know, that's how I support my man. 
Are you feeling my man? I'm gonna go full, full. Whatever you need. He locked up. The last thing he should be worried about is anything. I want your mental health. Like, you know what I'm saying? Like, it's a couple of niggas that lose their self in jail because they have the right support or the right person talking to them, praying with them, reading the word. Like, me and Blue read the word. We pray. That's all we need to worry about, praying. You feel me? You the same way? Wait, I know it's bitches that's like me, yo. Like, what the fuck? I don't need no nigga for no money or a place to stay. Them bitches... Them bitches need that. I don't need that. All I need is from you to show me that you really here for me. You feel me? That's it. I'm going to be who I'm going to be for you. You feel me? All right. We agree to make it. This is the first time we ever really said, let's do this this way and blah, 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 blah. Because niggas don't need no money, bro. Niggas don't need each, I don't need a nigga for no money or a place to stay. I'm sorry, no. And then I know who he is. Like when he has my back, when when you know what I'm saying, when he do shit, I don't need him to do without asking. But that's the other thing. It's like I'm not the type to teach you. It's like you teaching me who you are. So you feel me? Like, if you ain't picking up what's going on now, that's it, you know? I don't really care about anything else. It's like, nobody can shit on me, yo. I shitted on myself already when I tolerated a lot of shit that put me under, had me drowning in the water. You feel me? And I can't blame nobody but myself when that happens to me. You know what I'm saying? Like, all right. This shit, ooh, ooh, shit happening, da 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 Okay, what what did Krishan do? Well, Krishan didn't put a pers- a great parameter to protect herself, even if that was the case. You know what I'm saying? Like, no, nah, I'm a different bitch now. It's like, I don't care. Because this is the other thing. I don't like when hard shit happens to you, like bad shit happens to you, and it change your heart and make it hard. Like, I don't want to be that person that my heart gets so cold I start going against God. Like, I'd rather just get worked on with my discipline and, all right, let me prevent this by doing this. Not, oh, damn, I went through all this. Now I'm going to be like this person. Because what? There's such thing as real love, real self, self. What? That's, like, there is a place, like, where you can get your happiness, like, real life, like, you don't have to all you don't have to settle for nothing. You know what I'm saying? So it's like if you wanna settle for a position without addressing everything, it's crazy. Me, I'm not settling, bro. I'm addressing shit like as we go. As we go, let's address this as we go. Let's address how we treat and talk to each other as we go. Let's address what we don't like about each other as we go. You feel me? I'm addressing shit right now, like, you feel me, like, all right, cool, you mad about me not going home, but baby, stop playing with me, y'all, you can still respect me in this call, we can have an uncomfortable conversation, whatever the case may be, the disrespect is out, why, because I'm about to start disrespecting you back, what, bitch, shut the fuck up, you need to stay up in there, like, I said some reckless shit, like, but it was only because... That energy was reciprocated. It really was. So then he tried to reciprocate. This, this other thing. Then he reciprocated more. Like, oh, oh yeah, she said what she said. All right, let me unfollow her. Let me switch it up. Bro, you can't switch up shit, y'all. It's me switching up shit for us to actually work out and... Cause I, all I had to do was be where, where I was at. Like at one, like, 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 you can't. I can't take like I can't take my husband or my kid to heaven with me. We only there to serve God when we in heaven. 
I don't even think we remember our lives on earth while we in heaven and what we accomplished and what we did and blah, blah, blah. I don't even think we remember all that. I don't even think it goes like that. You feel me? So my perspective on things like that shit that got to be real and substantial, it just got to be real internally. Like some shit that, you know, you can enjoy while you while you here. Like I can't enjoy something that I can't trust. I can't enjoy something that don't want to grow. I can't enjoy vice versa. You feel me? So that's all that really matters. Like I was telling him, like, man, I feel you, but we can't argue the same like how we used to. That shit not even substantial. Then it's heartbreaking as fuck because. Only because, you know, it's not so heartbreaking that it like, I can't explain it, y'all. Y'all know me, y'all. Like, any anything that we play the get back game, like, he, he getting, at, getting back at me because I hung up. This would make, this would, if when I was childish back in, I'll, ret- I'll retaliate. I'll take it as, are you breaking up with me back? Well, I'm done. Ooh, ah, ah, ah. No, I'm just, and now I'm just taking notes. I'm just, I'm letting it play out. Like, I don't really retaliate nothing. Like, so the tattoo would never look crazy, yo. Like, that's the other thing, yo. I don't really have regrets and shit. If the tattoo was an ugly tattoo and the person that did it fucked up, yeah, I'll cry about it, but. Just like how y'all say I couldn't cover this up, where is his face at? In this. And I only did one session. I didn't even go back to do the other sessions. But you see the rose. It's rosin. So it's like, don't worry about the face part. But that's not even what I'm, that's not even the conversation. The fuck? He got, he got to let me know what's up, you know? Like, let me know what's up. I don't know what to do next. That's it. Right now, he's throwing a tantrum. And doing what he's doing just to hurt, just to make him feel. I don't know. Like, it's cool, but. Yeah, but I'm. Yeah, you're supposed to stay in the. Or at least make it home. Like, I'm not going to play with you. Dude. I get you, yo. But. You're not even being, like, real with yourself. Like, that's petty as shit how you do all that over me calling you a bitch. And I only called you a bitch because you really been one. Like, this my first son. You feel me? The next time I have a kid, I'm not having a kid out of a marriage. Like, you know what I'm saying? And I'm going to stick to that because, you know, I just want to do something different, not the same thing over. Because I've seen what it got me doing it the way I did it, you know? Not thinking, just going with the flow. Then the flow creates a current, and then the current is a dangerous situation because if the current gets you, there's no coming up from the current. Just get swallowed in. So, I don't know. I got a new perspective on life. I, I really look at shit different. And I don't need nobody but myself. So, it's like... See if he was my parent or my trick daddy or something. And you saying this and this and this is how it's going to go. Then I have to listen and all this other stuff. But then for partners, we listen to each other. And you don't just go to the worst scenario as soon as you get pissed off. Why? Because I could have did that a couple times. Like, you know, like that should be done. Girl, you really saw no bitch. I'm really like really loyal to people. It's not even about the internet. My identity, nothing. 
It's about what you need. And I'm there for you. The end of the story. You know? That's it. I know, Lyric Channel, you're trying to say, no, you're slow. Baby girl, I'm not, bro. Just because you, all your mistakes and your life is not documented and nobody can chime in on where you're slow at, you feel me? Like, you just, you slow about making that comment, to be honest. I don't even know who you are or you existed till you made the comment, so... It's like, who's slow? You, you're coming under somebody you don't even know. Just saying, everybody's trying to chime in and talk about the wrong shit. Amen. Just say uh, what you say. I'm just responding to everybody that you think I'm not gonna respond to because it's negative. You say what you say. I don't care. I don't care. What the fuck is going to take you for you to know your worth? As soon as he come home, he's gonna try, try to climb you, watch. What? You're not even supposed to be worried about what other people's gonna do. You know what I'm saying? I'm not worried about what you're gonna do. And if I gotta worry, then I'll relocate. Quick. Feel me? Tripping. I'm not worried at all. I'm set up nice. I'm grounded for real, internally. And nothing really, like, hurts for real. Like, it hurt because, okay, I try to give it a try. But it don't hurt, hurt. Like, it don't hurt. Shit don't hurt. Like, I'm telling you. This lifetime is really, like, short. We used to live for f over 500 years old. Now we only live up to, like, 100, if that. Some people blessed to go over 112, cool. That's super. 70, that's, that's normal. Okay, sometimes people die of natural causes. 50 or they just get killed randomly at a young age. So, you know what I'm saying? Okay, my point from all of that is short. Life is short. Starting all new, bro. So me and Blue Plan was to like get a new house together and blah 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 blah. God forbid, save me and Blue don't work out. I'm still gonna do the plans that I intended to do. You know, get a new house. Cause everybody know where I live because of the internet. So now I have to get like something that's like like private. So as whereas though you can't even look it up from the description of the house. But that took like me having to learn that from my first house to know all of this. Like, you know, like I can't explain it. You shouldn't have went back. It's not that I went back anywhere. I never left. All I did was 
got my shit together, got my own shit. So I can deal with people accordingly instead of dealing with them out of what they can do for me or that's how I know I truly love him. Cause once I got all my shit in my house, in my car and all this other stuff, like when I got all my shit to separate me from needing anything from this man, it wasn't even about what I needed. It was about what I want. And it was a relationship with a guy I'm really actually into, but Baby, I'm not gonna be crying with a river, a wolf, and not for y'all. I'm telling you, I'm really destined for like nothing but greatness. Like, with or without whoever would be with me, you know? Yeah. That's how I'm, I'm just. She had her own goals set and she accomplished them. She was never gone. Oh God, he not he ain't never did. He ain't never did for you. You did for him and continued to the fuck. I don't agree with that. <clears throat> like I'm too humble to like agree with that. Like yeah, I know who I am. Thank you Jesus that I'm my own mobile mogul, whatever that is, own person. Like I I don't have to show up with him to. Receive what I receive, whatever the case may be. But if I be honest, he vouched when I when I first met him. He like yeah, like it was just changes and seasons and seasons and changes. So that being said, the season I am and the change I am with him is just us learning how to understand each other. Like what? Okay, I can't get with that. Okay, I can't get with this. Okay, let's figure it out. Okay, cool, cool. Alright, you need regrouping? Cool, I'll go ghost. Cool. What? Are you? Uh, uh, cool, cool. You feel me? That's it. Only time I really was like popping my shit for real was when I felt hurt for real and I felt unheard and I was caring about all the wrong shit, honestly. I was caring about how I felt instead of what I need to become. Like, alright, Krishan, you need to become a stronger individual to, to deal with things on a mature level because you can't you can't stay somewhere for too long. It just doesn't it doesn't go, it doesn't go well. <coughs> like that's why I didn't do baddies. Uh, another go around unless it was paying me different or putting me like I, I had to be promoted to do something like it's just different. I'm not wasting time or money. Uh, me, I like to see things through. No, I'm not going off a of base of your liking, your whatever. I don't need it. You don't need it, you know? Like, y'all don't have to agree with me. Because I necessarily don't know y'all to agree or know anything about y'all either. No, what I like to do is I like to embrace my mistakes and just see it through. It's not necessarily like see it through, it's more like I gave my deadlines and shit. I gave my I've set my boundaries. I I did what I did. Now I have to see my see it through for me. 
Just personally. Oh, Blue called me. I said, yeah, he called you. Why he's still mad? I don't know why he called you. Why he mad? He need to call you when you come down. He's like, you know how he is. Yeah, but we're, I'm done dealing with how he is, bro. Like, if we can't really see eye to eye right now, that's weird. What? Nobody's not just be paying your bills for nothing, yo. I'm not going to be paying your bills and, 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 and you got to worry about trusting me. Nigga, you can trust a bitch, bro. We, we, we grew past that. Real shit, like, what the fuck? You feeling insecure over the phone and then trying to deflect all your insecurities on me is pissing me off because you an expensive ass motherfucker, so you need to watch your mouth. That's what my point was for real. He like, he just tired of hearing my point, so I'm just like, all right, well, I don't know what that is. I don't really give a fuck. That's what he needs you for. He don't need shit. Blue don't need anything. That's the thing about it. We're doing shit because we actually fuck with each other. It's just like, say if I agree on this and he agree on that. That's perfectly normal. Like, you know what I'm saying? That's, that's like, that's a normal trait to not agree all the time. I don't agree with none of my friends sometimes. And then we come to a common ground. Then we take accountability and then we regroup. And then we get stronger. Cool. That's what this is. A situation where it has to just do it, do its course. Because it sprung up for me calling him a bitch. And I only call him a bitch because it's like, like I said again. And I'm going to keep saying Watch your mouth. Nobody over here just taking care of shit for no reason. Just being here for you for no reason, yo. Like, chill out. I was big and still would be big and loud about what, you know what I'm saying? Yeah, I got to keep repeating it because I keep reading comments.
But no, I'm just in this bitch. You know, I really don't care about Like nobody can, nobody can actually play play you for real. If anything, you played yourself if you let somebody play you. So it's like you. I don't know. But I'm about to get up off of here. That was my little vetting session. Uh, we'll keep y'all updated on my saga. like these I think he like the grape one because it's like more his style of life and stuff. Uh, um, I sketched out. Yeah. I sketched out this whole like um, uh, what's this called? Uh um. The thing that you put in your mouth. A teething, yes. I sketched out a whole teething situation for him. He loves it. It's so funny.
Cause like um when they first start teething, uh, cause I can't explain it. I just designed something, and it was just because me just being a mom. I'm like, do they have these? Is this so I created something that they don't have on the market that could be very beneficial for babies. No way am I getting this tattoo covered up. I'm not doing anything, bro. What the hell? I'm let him do this. Like, you know? Not when a man just feel below themselves, so they just cut out everything. Like, this is how I feel. I feel like I've been in his corner, so me trying to voice how I felt, it didn't go well, so then I even went further enough to disrespect them. So this is him retaliating. I don't think this is like uh, something that serious for real. I know this hair gets so hot, but it'd be so cute when it's down. It's right now, I just need to wet it, even the top part. But it's like. Yeah. Oh, no, I'm not the same crochet no more. I'm, I'm wiser. And I'm more like content. And more in control of me and my situation. And that's the only thing that matters. You know uh, what I put on the screen that he loves? It's called Minnow's Bible. Have you ever watched Minnow's Bible? It's for babies, kids. He loves the little, the songs they have on there, the colors. I can just tell he's into it. Read your Bible, vent to God. Yeah, I did that. And I'm going to do that right after this live, too. I'm just being transparent because I don't... It's like, it'd be funny because when he do stuff, it's like, bro, you know, you did just did something. So now I got to explain myself. Just for my sake. Uh-oh. 
my stuff froze up, so I can't really see if you're commenting or not, or any white comments. Um. It's so funny though, cause it's he don't stay mad at me for long. Plus, I guess whenever he's ready to talk, we gonna talk about. But this other thing, he don't like when I call him bitch. So it'd be like one of his little traits where he like try to prove a point. When I call him a bitch, but it'd be like, he'd be bitching the fuck out of me on the phone. I'd be like, bro. What? I'd see if you was doing something. You're not even on child support. I don't even do that type of shit either, but it's like, you're not on any of that shit. And I'm not begging or asking for no money. So, you trying to pop it, because I didn't go home, was crazy. And then I don't even think that's why you mad. He mad because I hung up and said what I said. That's not, like, he was mad that he, he but he get over it when we over the phone. It was just like, I'm tired of, like, letting him be mad at something. It be getting on my nerves. Like, I see if I was, like, really cutting the fuck up and just doing wrong by him and cool. All right, yeah, you got something to be mad about. It would really hold you down, yo. Oh, my God. And so committed in it. Like, I've never been committed in my life like this. Like, yeah, I used to deal with Blue in the beginning and shit, but I was dealing with other people. This time I'm dealing with Blue, I don't deal with nobody. You feel me? And that's, that's like, real shit. So it's like, all right, can we stop acting like, um... You got worried or something? Damn, I must have traumatized you or something? Damn. But you traumatized me too, so... You feel me? But that don't even matter for real. It's just like, what the fuck? What's going on? You good? If not, that's cool. I ain't no fucking follower. I'm gonna get my clarity. I'm gonna, I'm gonna talk to him. And yeah, then we can handle that. All that. Oh, he unfollows you and switched up his Instagram. Yeah, because I called him a bitch. Yeah, let me know something before I really switch up my whole program. Like, you know, like I ain't gonna be switching up just because you pout and mad about something real stupid. But that's my little story. I'm about to open up these gifts. So I have gifts, but I wanted to do it on Snapchat. I don't know where they came from, but they came from some fans. So thank you so much. This is really sweet. And it's funny because I finally got a picture. Of them. Like someone, basically I, I can see the receipt right here of what it is, but when I open it, I know I'm gonna be like, oh my God, I'm happy. So, yeah, I'm going to do that, clean up, and uh, I don't know, rest for real. I do need some sleep. I ate already. But I'm waiting for the baby. He's going to get tired soon because he's playing with his little toys.
Why are you laughing like that? <laughs> 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 Why are you laughing He loves avocado. He likes avocado. We've been new. He likes mashed potatoes. Carrots. Because look, this stuff's still in here. I don't... So I'm going to throw this away, but I feel bad for buying it. But it's funny because when I bought it, right? Um, and I was ready to open it, but then I read the ingredients. And I'm just like, I could do that. I could make that. And it would be like... You know, like it'll be fresh. So I make. So I make this in a blender, pretty much. Uh, sweet potato. I haven't tried my own sweet potato, so. See, look, the ingredients, sweet potato, water, vitamin C, uh, ascorbic ro acid. Why? Like, what? what's the oven? You know what I'm saying? What? I guess to keep it, like, without going bad, without being in the refrigerator, because, you know, what food in that real mind that could just sit on the shelf? Because if I made it fresh, right, just with the blender and just water, if I even need water. So, um... It just, you know, with blender, woo woo. If I conceal it, put it in like a thing like this, and, um, that's why I'm scared to do stuff that's like already pre cooked because if I made it naturally and did it my way and then try to conceal it and then put it on the shelf, it's gonna go bad naturally. That food, I don't know why it doesn't expire, it doesn't go bad. So I just don't know if that's safe, you know, just because I don't fucking know. I just feel like fresher. Like, okay, boom. This is organic pear. We go to the ingredients. The ingredients, look. The ingredients say organic pears, organic lemon, juice concentration, concentrated. Okay. That don't even sound right. Like, I know apples that go bad if if if, if it's not eaten. You know what I'm saying? So it's like, this food in a jar is not going bad at all. Somebody help me explain that. Like, explain that. Oh, yeah, I can't even see our comments no more. And this the other thing I don't like about, uh... I don't know. It say refrigerate after opening, use in three days. So yeah, I guess. But it's like, how do they just get it out to? Like, is it fresh for real? How long was it sitting? When was this made? When was it shipped out? So this went through a whole journey of getting to the store. Then it goes into my cabinet. But it's like we probably fifteen days in. Sixteen. I don't even know how fresh this stuff is. So, I don't really give him, and it's funny, he don't, he just, uh, his binky, he don't use it. He just, like, use it to make his gums feel good. Then, uh, these, um, this, these are actually not that bad. You know, these are, I can read this. They're soft, it's like, they dissolve so quick. So it teaches them how to like chew and stuff. Um, I tasted it. It tastes like nothing. It tastes like air. I can taste it again because I must have forgot. Let me let me be for real. Let's see. But it's for teasers, gentle teething waffles, waff, wa wafers. Um, the ingredients is rice flour, tapico starch, sugar, strawberry pure, sh dried up apple juice, dried spinach. Oh, I got spinach in it. Mixed taco goo goo. I don't know what that is. To maintain freshness. 
So basically, they make these shit. They make this shit with stuff that ma- maintain the freshness, and that's just. I don't know if that even if that's important or not. So, like you know, I know it's fresh, but is it supposed to be fresh this long? So this is a way for it. To, It don't taste too much, and they got a scent of baby strawberry, but it's like I taste more chemicals than food. I don't know if, um, I don't know. So basically, when you have a child, it's like you want to be the chef of everything they put in their mouth. And then that stuff be also like, it's very time consuming, but I love it. I'm going to do like a get ready with me too. I can't wait. Do a little get ready with me. Me and Junior. And the funny thing is, he's learning how to clear his throat. Like, he be having, like, spit in his throat from, like, I guess, getting a bottle. And he hear, like, <clears throat> or, like, this is stuff I noticed that he do different now. He's rolling, crawl, and he's doing a lot. Like, I don't know, I'm excited. He's getting bigger. This is gonna be a journey. Cause at first I used to just sit him on the bed, right? Run the shower, right? This time I don't just sit him on the bed, I take him with me because I'm like, He's going, he's going to end up off the bed. And I could put him in the middle of the bed. He got to be somewhere strapped up for me to feel like, oh, he's security. He's right there. If I just lay him on his back, he turns around and just. It's just beautiful. But I don't know. I don't know what the like I don't really care for the um negative hateful things y'all say. Only thing I'd be like kinda like confused about is I don't know. It's like I never been like this baby's so fucking famous, it's crazy. <laughs> like people is really like fake concern, fake trolling, fake aunties on the Instagram. I'm like, girl, ciao. Leave me the fuck alone. It's my child. Please. Please. <laughs> but I, I don't really be caring, though. I think it's because I'm a true, like, a, a, a true, like, I'm truly somebody's mom. Like, if you're somebody's mother, you don't care what they say about your kid. As long as they know the Lord, respectful to you and others, and it's not troublemaker that you know what I'm saying this baby's so precious so perfect y'all could say anything about him it's not gonna bring me down it's not And the other things he's been saying, he's saying, da, 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 da. And he yells. Like, he yells. Like, he be, like, yelling.
Come on, I got you. I got you. And I got them this little thing that he just keep bouncing in. And then why y'all post this video talking about look at Krishan J that is not my baby. Somebody probably thought it looked like my child and they trolled my child because my child is a headline. Posted it, said, look at Krishan Jr. And that was not him. I'm like, why is people this crazy? <laughs> Nothing wrong with the video. I'm just like, why lie though? That's not even the baby.